What are your feelings on milk? What? I like my partner eggs on my... What? <laughs> ooh, ooh. I have learned how to contour. Y'all, I am unstoppable. <laughs> Hi friends, my name's Flabbergasted today and I am flabbergasted at my makeup. That's nothing to do with the video. Today, we're gonna be talking about gayness, homosexuality, queeraciousness, that stuff. Because I don't know about you, but actually I do know because y'all gay too. Did I lie? I am exposing you. I get a lot of am I gay ads on my YouTube channel. I will literally be scrolling down like Pokemon remakes and watching League of Legends gameplay. And then somehow there's a am I gay quiz. And I'm just thinking who let these be on YouTube. Why are YouTube ads so peculiar and catered that specific? Most of the time YouTube gets it incredibly wrong. Like I'm not going to be using tampons or pads anytime soon I hope. And part of me feels like if I click on the ads they're going to hack me or take my information like they didn't already. But either way I'm going down those quizzes because I used to as a kid. When I was in eighth grade what did I do? Look up are you gay? And the first question was, do you like men? And I just thought, they know me, they're on to me. But I do want to caution you all because I know like I have a young audience. Be careful on the internet. Don't go on random websites because they could easily hack you or your parents can track you too. I've had firsthand experience with that. But if you want to prevent that, this is a perfect segue into my sponsor, Surfshark VPN. Are you gay? Do you look at things? <laughs> Do you value your privacy as a homosexual being on this planet or just a homo sapien? Unless you identify as a potato. Well, thanks to VPNs, that stands for Virtual Private Network, not Vagina Penis Nipple. I had to look that one up myself. You're allowed to be private on the internet and protect yourself from potentially being hacked, having your information taken. Most of the time, I use it just because I get paranoid. I'm a popular girl, like, People might want to take my information. Well. So I don't want to risk any of that. And also, you get to technically be anywhere on the internet. You want to watch Drag Race, but it's not in your country. Well, go ahead and be in a different country, and then you can watch it. My favorite places to put my VPN are in Canada, England, and Mexico, because I can get almost any movie I want just by scrolling through those three. So if you're interested, you can use my code right here. It's also in the description to get 83% off, and you get three months free. Is that not the biggest deal? It's not even Black Friday, y'all. And the best part is Surfshark gives it to you for 30 days free. So if you don't like it, you can just give it back and you get your refund. Maybe you just want to watch a season of Drag Race and you're done. Who cares? Now let's surf these interwebs. <laughs> Why do I sound old? I'm not even I'm not old, Frederick. Don't do that. Oh, here we go. This is it. The first thing you see, am I gay rainbow flag? <laughs> What, and then the fist? What is it saying? Like, you should take this quiz. Well, you got me, I'm gonna do it. Maybe I should preface this. Don't do the quiz to determine your sexuality. You don't even have to label yourself ever. But if you're curious about your own sexuality, I would just say, look them up, watch other videos in terms of how they feel, and just know that you don't have to rush discovering it. Sexuality is a spectrum, so we don't have to categorize it. And you don't have to categorize yourself, especially if you're young, because it develops. You can just say questioning, you can just say I don't know, because it's okay to not know. In fact, I would prefer it if y'all don't know instead of trying to rush to figure it out, because you shouldn't rush this. It's your life. It's not society's, it's not the internet's, it's not some stupid movie with the unrealistic coming out scene. Don't get pressured by that or me or this quiz or YouTube ads. So I just wanted to look up quiz test am I gay? See how popular this was. The New York Times has covered it. You covered that but not me. <laughs> Why are there so many quizzes about this? Like maybe we should take them all. Okay, I want to see what New York Times has to say about this. Oh, it's about someone who discovered their sexuality through the quiz. Well, good for you. I want to do the same thing. Maybe this will actually tell me who I am. There's 408 people viewing this quiz right now. Mm, hey, are we all gay here? This is a safe space. What's your opinion about Pride Month? I mean, some people might call me homophobic for those videos. I'll say the whole year should be Pride Year. I, I've said that before, so that makes sense. Do you, what is this image? Do you like to do things that the other sex stereotypically does? For example, bra wearing if you're a guy. Well, I wear 
makeup. I mean, I like to think we don't have to associate certain things with other like genders or in this case sex but we know that's not gonna happen anytime soon so yeah i enjoy it wow enjoying it um i don't think i'm a wow i think i'm from time to time do you have any gay friends joey yeah okay i have one such i have one friend it's joey um i have wait where's like some it goes most yes you have one friend most and no, I don't have more gay friends than straight ones because like percentage wise, this doesn't make sense. I guess I'll say most. I mean, that that's, that feels general, but it doesn't mean you're necessarily queer if you have more gay friends because my friend is straight. She has a bunch of gay friends. How about going to bed with someone of the same sex? Uh, well, uh, I mean, <laughs> not looking too good for me, y'all. Very interesting. What are these answers? Desirable, disgusting, negative. Desirable, I guess? I don't think it's interesting. I'm, I'm used to it. Have you ever been called gay slash lesbian? Oh, who hasn't? This isn't fair. These answers though, never. Once or twice, but they had some reason for it. What was the reason? Once or twice and I didn't like it. Oh, constantly. However, I like it. Sometimes I don't like it because it can be derogatory. If I was taking this in eighth grade, I wouldn't have liked it obviously so i'm just gonna say constantly however i like it oh you know what we should do we should take this quiz with the mindset of me in middle school we'll do that next there's 30 questions oh shit. okay would you watch a some kind of a some kind of porno with both actors of your gender this is the only kind of porn that i watch ew never i often watch it with pleasure it was a couple of times but i prefer to normal porn what's normal nothing's normal about it let's just say I skip this one? I'm not answering on screen. Who is attractive for you? You mean the left or the right guy? <laughs> I mean, everyone is attractive to me. They're, everyone's beautiful besides like homophobes. I'll say this one. People of both sexes, but more often the, the same sex. Cause women are attractive. Yeah, y'all cute. I said it. I wouldn't want to die without having experimented sexually with the same sex. Yeah, good Lord. Definitely not mm, the Lord part. I'm really doing it there. <laughs> yeah, I'd rather not die being alone. What are your sexual fantasies about? Oh, we're not getting into it. Oh, we, we just meant in terms of our partner's sex. Oh, of course, yep. Who have you already had sex with? The people of my own sex. The people, <laughs> my people. Have you ever stared at someone cute or beautiful of your gender? Who, I mean, who hasn't? That is the thing. If you're like a straight person, how can you not look at another person of your same sex and be like, Damn, they're attractive. Like, what? Get over yourself. Just admit it. If I can admit that Adele is hot, like, why can't you admit that Harry Styles is... Let's use desirable, because that's the key word today. Word of the day. Put it up there. Desirable. I am gay. I'm gay. How not to stare. Who made this quiz? What do you feel when you see a person of the same sex naked? Uncomfortable. <laughs> Slight disgust. There it is. This depends. Like, I don't want to see an old person no offense to old people i would be disgusted by that like i've been to the gym locker rooms as a kid at like the public centers i don't want to see it again but like people of my own age sure i'll just say usually though have you kissed a person of the same sex never no <laughs> yes have you ever had a sexual dream involving a same gender person never why would i Imagine me making this video before coming out. Like, this would be so sad. Oh, there's a typo here. I've ne I've had once or twice sex y'all dreams. Were you ever afraid to tell your family about you? Of course. I rarely speak to them about it. <laughs> Look at this. Their eyes are still now wide open. Nowadays, I rarely speak because we don't care. But I like the fact they put their eyes are still wide open. If you discover that your friend is gay, what would you do? Is this like some sort of test? Like those YouTube videos? What would you do if your friend was gay? I will support them. Yes, everyone, this is my same sex partner. I'm doing in my gay quizzes today. What do you want? What do you need? Your shirt? You're making me get up! What are your feelings on milk? Milk? Okay, this is so. What? Um, what does the. <laughs> what? Before I look at the answers, I just want to talk about it. I freaking hate milk. I don't get why people like the taste of cow's milk. Soy milk is the only one. Almond milk can also die. Cashew's good. Coconut's okay. Rice milk is like dependable. Oat milk, god tier. It's just a little expensive. But like the Kirkland Costco soy milk. If y'all sponsor me, I would... <laughs> I'd be like this girl on my screen. I would do that with the milk. It's just cow's milk can, can rot. Okay, because it literally rots. Let's look at the answers. I don't like it at all. I have lactose intolerance. I can't imagine my day without milk. I only eat sweets with milk. But how does this pertain to one's 
gayality, queerness, homo sapien. I don't like it at all, but we know what they meant by that. Nasty whores. How do you like your eggs in the morning? You're just, are they like baiting me because of the, the man behind it? Like what? I like my partner eggs on my, what? Do str do, do guys sexualize egg? Is that a thing? Can you tell me? <laughs> do y'all sexualize this stuff? It's food. It's breakfast. Breakfast only. Good lord. I like hard boiled eggs. I will say that. But I also like scrambled. I like sunny side up. Not raw or whatever they want. What's your opinion on Elton John? He's a great singer. What do you see in this first picture? I see an hourglass. Naked body. What? Where? Perverts. Sex toys. Where? Ancient building columns, I guess. Oh God. What was your first that caught your eye? Um, the butt. <laughs> but it's also like the glass. Oh, the butt is not an option, so I guess we're going with the glass. How do you act when a person of same sex flirts to you? You know what? I'll show you. Hi, Frederick. Um. <laughs> hey. <laughs> I act awkward. Who do you think I am? I am all of these answers actually, because I can flirt back if it's like someone I like. But I also don't flirt with anyone anymore besides. You know, my, my girlfriends. I don't like other people to see me in public. True, get away from me. Social distance, six feet still. I tell them to stop. Please stop. I do that to Joey. <laughs> I can talk to them and have fun, but nothing over the limits. I will just say that. That seems sane. Do you like to dress up unconventionally? No. I mean, I do this when I'm home alone, true. I, I dress up like this at parties, I guess. Like this, because I look good. Have you ever been to a gay bar? No, I'm not legal. I would love to though. I want to see some drag shows. It's not fair. I'm 20, one more year. What do you think about the League of Beauty community? Yes, that's what I call it now. I'm part of them. Mmm, I support them when I can. <laughs> I'll be part of it. I'm gonna have this talk. Sometimes I feel like this community is a little messed up. What do you first think if a same sex person invites you to drink a coffee? What are you trying to do? What's the coffee? Where, Starbucks? Or is it a local New York City restaurant? No, they don't wanna have sex with me. If you pick the third one, a little self-centered. They wanna form a friendship. Come on, let's be normal. You think gay people should have kids? No, I don't think anyone should have kids. There's too many children in this world. I'm kidding. Yes, we must fight about discrimination. Against discrimination, grammar. This one, all people should have kids? Hell no. I know some of y'all not responsible enough to have a children. There's a reason so many children said they wish they were never born. I'll leave it at that. Do you make jokes about gay people all day, every day? <laughs> and I find them very funny. Will you accept a gay roommate? I mean, I kind of have to. I don't care who will be my roommate as long as they're a good person. Yeah, that's a good one. What do you think if you see gay people in public? Ew. <laughs> I don't like to see them. <laughs> um, I wouldn't start a conversation because that's kind of weird. Don't talk to strangers all the time. So I will see them as normal people. You are definitely gay. Are we sure though? Like, what about like 90%? <laughs> are you sure about that? Oh, ah. ah. I see the light. <laughs> I, I saw heaven for a second. Okay, one for one. They got it right, let's do it again. I just looked up, am I gay quiz? We're gonna do the first one. Now we're gonna do this in the mindset that I'm in eighth grade and I'm questioning and I have homophobic at the time parents. Have you ever kissed a person of the same sex? No, my first kiss was like high school. Have you ever fantasized about kissing a person of the same sex? I mean, at the time, I'll say once or twice. Let me tap into that brain. Frederick, go back to eighth grade. Legos, silly bands. <laughs> Minecraft. <laughs> Were you ever afraid to tell your family about your sexual or romantic preferences? Hell yeah! Do you often find yourself reviewing your interactions with Bo Jenners to see who you like the most? Yeah, I did that actually. <laughs> I was like, do I like this girl because boobs or nice? Do I like this guy because they're nice or boobs? <laughs> when you see a beautiful couple walking by, who do you notice first? How good they look together? I don't even remember. Are you looking for the answer seriously or just here for fun? I'd like an honest answer. When you see a homosexual couple kissing on the screen, what do you feel? I didn't really see them as a kid, so <laughs> nothing, I guess, because I didn't see it ever. Are you comfortable in talking about sexual identity issues? No. <laughs> when your friends are talking about homophobic stuff, what do you do? At the time, I was like, yeah, bro, that's gay. Uh. I didn't really participate, though. I just did it when prompted, so I'll say B, but also D. If your friend would come out, what would be your reaction? I think I'd support them in eighth grade. I don't know. I kind of feel bad because, like, I did 
I did bully a kid for being gay. It was just my own insecurities. But I mainly bullied him because he was annoying too. So that was just me being a shitty person. So Peter, I'm sorry. I hope you're doing good. Um, I was a shitty person in middle school. Do your friends know your sex? No. Mm -mm. None of them. Not until ninth grade. Have you ever participated in a pride parade? No, they do not exist. Do you have homosexual friends? I don't think I had any at the same time. They were probably closeted. But fun fact, all of them accepted me. So I just grew up in a weird place in Charleston, I guess. Do you think that gender stereotypes are incorrect and offensive? I don't even know what stereotypes were in eighth grade. So like not all, some of them, how about that? Choose a singer. Sia Halsey, Bruno Mars, Miley Cyrus, Harry Styles, Jennifer Lopez. Well, at the time, I think I only listened to like Sia. Was she even there back in eighth grade? That was a long time ago. I listened to like Sia Miley and Bruno, so um, Miley. But listening to an artist does not make you gay. Have you ever happened to like a celebrity more after they're coming out? I don't think anyone came out in eighth grade unless it was like Joey Graceffa, Tyler Oakley, Connor Franta, so yeah, I guess. Do you communicate with your homosexual? I had none of them, so I don't have them. Oh, 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 girl. Let's not glitch right now. Have you joined an online League Beauty community anonymously? I did not know those existed. Have others ever confused you with a homosexual? <laughs> <laughs> there were some rumors. Wow, thank you for the 18 plus warning. Y'all, if you're 18, you can continue watching. If you're not, get out. Have you ever watched same sex pornography? Do you ever avoid? <laughs> I'm not doing that on camera, okay? It's inappropriate. Do you avoid a movie or TV show if you know it features home? I didn't know of any at the time. I'm like 12 at this time. Do you think homosexual people should be given better rights more respect than they have now? Um. Sure. I'll just say B. I don't really know much. Have I ever dreamt about being romantically involved with a person of the same sex? No, because my dreams were mainly about like being killed, falling off bridges, uh, running over my parents because of Final Destination. So to my sister, I know you're watching right now, I hate you for showing me Final Destination 1 through 5 as a child. That messed me up. I didn't even know movies were movies. I thought they were real life. Sidetrack, when people died in movies at the time, I literally thought they died. So yeah, I'm a little traumatized from things. Was I also incredibly dumb? Yes. Who do you find more attractive? Angelina Jolie or Brad Pitt? Um, Angelina? Dog? How's your gaydar working? I have awful gaydar to this day. Imagine someone of the same sex comes up and kiss you. What is your reaction? <gasps> do I know you? <laughs> Cause that's weird. Let's not do that. What book would you rather read right now? Harry Potter. Harry Potter? I didn't know any of these as a kid, but like today I would read that. Did you read League Beauty books slash watch movies? No, cause they didn't exist. Do you like wearing clothes of the opposite genre? I mean, if we're talking about like skirts and dresses, no, not at the time. I did wear my mom's silk dress to bed though, cause it was freaking comfortable. And today she's like, I didn't know that was a sign, though you just like them. Can you easily discuss sexual orientation issues? With uh, no, never. You go both ways. Oh my God. Actually, I did the, first of all, this image. <laughs> I did think at the time I was bisexual. I think most people will be like, yeah, I'm bi as like the gateway, especially if you're insecure about it. Like you don't want to admit you're fully gay. So that's what I did. Then again, I also did that with like being vegan. I said, I'm pescatarian. And then I went vegan two weeks after. That was fun. I liked those questions more. They felt more toned down, less about milk and eggs. I want to do one more though. Just am I gay quiz? Oh my God. This one has 4.9 ratings and it's free. What do you consider yourself right now? What? Oh, I'm looking at the wrong, <laughs> looking at the wrong quiz. Um, I'm gay, but that's not fair. <laughs> well, whatever. Have you ever had feelings for a member of the same sex? Yes, I was in love. Have you ever had feelings for a member of the opposite sex? Technically I have. I used to think I liked girls. So let me use that to my advantage. Have you ever experienced something considered gay? What's considered gay? Oh, oh, I guess. Have ever experienced something considered straight? Um, I've done this and cuddling, not sex. So I'll just say kissing. It was a dare. Who cares? Can you imagine to enjoy touching or caressing the j the j Why are they fingering a flower? Sure. Can you imagine to enjoy touching or caressing the gender of a member of the opposite sex? No, no offense. I think it's gross. <laughs> I don't know what I do. That's. It's freaking weird. I didn't even know where it was as a kid. I literally thought, I don't wanna get into it. I thought it was on your thigh. My lack of knowledge is due to the education system. I'm blaming it on the education system. What do you find more attractive, papaya or banana? I'll say this is kind of flip-flop because sex is not gender, but also like they don't. 
I like people, but romantically, they would identify as a male or present like a male. So I'm just gonna say same to be safe. Okay, is that fair? Imagine the following. Okay. You're alone on a vacation. There's a pineapple in front of you. <laughs> no one knows you're there. You can do whatever you want. A hot member of the opposite sex. Um, let's talk. Let's dance. Ooh. I'm gonna blur that. I wanna be safe on here. A straight friend tells you they've lost their virginity and starts to describe what straight sex feels like. What do you feel? Disgusted! I am repulsed by the idea. Exactly. A gay friend, I need to blur that. Um, a gay friend tells you they have lost their virginity and starts to describe what gay sex is like. What do you feel? I am repulsed by it. Cause I don't like talking about it in public. Who gets hor- no. Horny jail for you. Have you ever found yourself staring at a member of the same sex because you thought they were really good looking? Who hasn't? I like that second one. You really did that? You went that far? Have you ever found yourself staring at a member of the opposite sex because of- Yes. Yes. Do you have a crush at the time? Sure. Your result gay. You're probably homosexual. Probably. Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> You're probably homosexual. And that's okay. Gay people find members of the same sex attractive. Aw, this is like educational. Well, thank you, um, goodbye. I feel so much more enlightened now. Thank you to these quizzes for telling me what I am. <laughs> thank you to the internet for telling me what I am. No, you know who you are. If you don't know, that's okay. Don't do these quizzes unless you're like doing it for fun. And that's it. Thanks to Surfshark again for sponsoring me. I hope you, you know, saved this phone from being hacked because there's like information on here I would not like to be leaked to the public. <clears throat> my pictures of me kissing my plants. If you enjoyed, give it a like, leave a comment down below of what you want me to do next. And as always, subscribe for more videos every week. I try to post every Saturday. And if I'm late, just turn on my post notifications. Social medias are right here, or, you know, honestly, I keep forgetting. So I'm going to say they're here. If I'm wrong, I blame myself. In Fanner of the Week, I keep forgetting to do this. I'm sorry. It is, this is, oh, look at it. Like, look at it. My mind! That is what I think I look like going out of the house. That's what I think I look like waiting in the water. You're amazing. Thank you for drawing that. And thank you all for drawing fan art. I will try to get this done because I am a forgetful hoe. A forgetful homosexual hoe, that is, thanks to this quiz. I'll stop. I love you all. Everything is less than three. And yes, I will react to Q-Force. God, like, give me a break, okay? Let me relax for a week. School just started and you're already pressuring me about it. You're ungrateful. Ungrateful is what you are.